Welcome to my custom antelope run. I'm Knifeo29 and here's what's in our backpack. We are overweight. But we have a whole bunch of coal. Uh, we're gonna take that up to, what is that? Wherever, whatever cabin that is, see? I don't know. Uh, we got some go energy. I don't know if I need that. We got these gloves, 1.2. Uh, you are two. I'm gonna leave those somewhere. For now, uh, we got lots of meat, we got lots of water, uh, we got two pots on us. We have this to continue making arrows. Well, yeah, we got four more arrows we can make, and there we go. We are day 131, and here's our skills. There we go. And we are early morning. Let's get outside. And see what we can do. This pack is getting kind of heavy. Uh, do that. Take you off. Use a book, I guess. I like those gloves too. I just don't know that they're as warm, right? Come on, little fire. I'm gonna do that and that should keep us warm there we go uh so what do we got two hours and we just have the deer meat so we'll throw that on 40 minutes Do it this way. One arrow at a time. Throw you guys down here. Uh, what is that? They have slightly less normal warmth and more wind protection, plus a little other, it evens out in it to you. <clears throat> what exactly is wind protection, though? I don't get what that actually does in the game. I'm not sure. <laughs> like, does it affect how cold it is? I don't know. Oh, don't you give us a blizzard now. Oh, and we... Oh, we don't have another arrow shaft. Okay. I don't think we had anything... ...in here, did we? We just had the three. I got some maples. Oh, what's our... Uh, you're at 92, okay. When the wind is warm, it gives a little... Uh, when the wind is high, it gives a little warmth against that. Hmm. What do we have for leather? We don't have any leather, so we would have to tear apart one of the well this pair of gloves uh 245 and minus three 2.3 57 and minus one your point seven five watch i'm gonna do that and find out this takes just cloth <laughs> yeah that's 22 minutes 14. Actually, let's do this one. Uh, 40 minutes. Let's do that. 
I'm not sure I can carry much more. All right, we gotta put those on. Do another point five. We don't really need the water. I just figure, you know, gotta do something while we're waiting for this. All right, uh, these pots. The pots can stay here because we do have two pots of our own. And actually, let's leave one here. I need a piece of coal. Uh, I want to leave 10 pieces of coal up top. Right. What I don't want to do is leave this in the back where I may not see it. You can go there. Uh, how's our other clothing? 80, 80, 80. We got three. We're good. Alright. Your hatchet only. Your hatchet only. Well, let's uh, work on these repairs. We do have a little bit of extra cloth on us. With this much gear. And we'll do you, you're 22 more minutes. Eighty-nine. All right. So that gives us five pieces. We have three here. Just so we don't get into a situation where I use a piece of cloth when I needed more bandages. Uh, what do we got here? We don't need you. I should have dropped you outside. And lots of meat and lots of water. Uh, what do we got? We only have one. Oh, is that fire? Oh, there's no way that fire's still going. No chance. Did not think so. Okay, well, whatever. I was going to make another birch bark tea, but you can go there. Actually, I'm going to, you know what? I'm going to throw you in the front too, just so I can see you. not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. Go there. Uh, we got two rose hips here. Do we have another one that we can see? We do. Well, we may as well grab those. Um, we might end up breaking down some wood inside. Just kill some time. But first... We're gonna do that. Alright, and we had two of those. We have six. Uh... Yeah, I guess. Go grab that other hatchet. It's at 85. It's not exactly a nasty one, but... Alright, what do we want to break down? Let's start... with these cardboard boxes. And I think that table will be after the box. Over here. So much for my stand for those cans. You can go there. Are you a no hatchet? Oh, you're a no hatchet. This pack is getting too heavy to carry. Oh, it's it's strictly hatchet. Okay. Well, looks like we're not going anywhere. All 
I'm gonna leave these outside because it's so hard to see inside this house. Just leave you guys out here. Here, let's put you right there. Uh, jerry cans. Can go there. Tinder plugs. I don't know where I'm gonna throw those. chair well it's basically nighttime but we can't really go to sleep now can we 30 minutes I think that's all I'm going to break down for now. Uh, what did I have in here? Um, all right. I can barely walk with this much gear. Oh, we can't take those down. You can be taken down. And you. We gotta eat and drink. How much wood did we get out of all that? 17 more. All right. Let's go outside. Uh, maybe we'll go out behind the house and throw these tinder plugs back there. Uh, but in the meantime Drop you out here Throw the tender plugs right in this little corner And uh oh I got time Go back in. I'm not going to be able to carry this. Yeah, that's hatchet only. Um, well, I guess let's just sleep and when we wake up, we wake up, right? I think we'll get like five hours. That's not that bad, I guess. Not too, too bad. pass time for a few hours and then get an hour's worth of sleep in right about there and hopefully it's daylight close the belly we're gonna drop some of this meat obviously we're not walking all over the place with a whole bunch too heavy to carry. what does that do for our sense right now anyway it's two bars is this a bad spot let's drop that amount Take this and get a little bit more daylight. 
there we can start to see now at least uh your hatchet only and your hatchet only right you're an hour and a half i didn't even look at you you're an hour i'm gonna do that because our hatchet was at 98 and it should be i believe at 94 now right 96 i meant yeah In the last five days of your game in Sundered Pass, three of them have been glimmer fog all damn day. It's been annoying. Yes. Yes. I can agree with that. All right, we got five more of those. Uh, all right, well, we have to go to Rudiger's hideout. I know where that is. I just don't know the quickest way to get to it. Oh, is that where we came from? Interesting. All right, we got 33 arrows for the time being. Ooh, we got a big, fat, juicy buck. I'm kind of nervous about going too far because I mean, this could turn into another blizzard. Let's see if we can summon Darth. You've been fishing in this pond. Oh, sure getting cold. Oh, look at that. You can. But it's too windy. We got to go. Um, where are we going? Actually, I don't know. All right. We're at 49. Ooh, maybe I should have. The hell? Maybe I should have dropped. I'm so cold. I didn't get to think. The reclaimed wood. Um, I think we might end up just going along the path. Uh, if I can find my way there. Is that it right there? I think that's right, right there. We'll see. It might be safe passage now because we did go that way the first time, right? So the wolves should be dealt with. Just kind of a matter of whether or not the timber wolves have respawned. They shouldn't have, not yet. Uh, is this actually the way? Today's word is wettability. Okay, it is the way. Good, good, good. Which means the degree or extent to which something absorbs or can be made to absorb moisture. See, I like, I like words like that that have uh, some chance of us using it one day <laughs> as opposed to words that like six people in the world have ever used a total of 10 times combined 
How some of those words even make it into a dictionary? I have no idea. I thought words had to be used a specific amount of times before they were considered an actual word. XMs use that word a thousand times in industry. Nice. That's not a new one for you then. Alright. I'm in a pickle because I gotta warm up, but I don't want to use the coal that I'm bringing. You know what I'm saying? But I think we might have to. The next cabin's a ways off. Um, we probably can do one stint of running. Try to get there a little quicker. Maybe we don't have to have a fire. One bar of scent. Uh, yeah, I, I know that I dealt with wolves in this little tunnel before. But I do think that I've dealt with all these others recently enough that it shouldn't be a problem. Minus 12. Yeah, we gotta go up and around that. Still quite a ways away. And yeah, maybe we'll try another stint of running. Oh, actually, I forgot about this cabin. <laughs> I was thinking about the one around the corner that's over on to the left. Oh, I should. There we go. And give us something to do while we're warming up. Get into the cabin, eh? Oh, hey. Well, no point leaving you guys here. That will be three more arrow shafts. There we go. And we are fully warm now, so... We'll just eat and drink and go. May as well fill the belly, right? And... You know what I'm gonna do, actually? I'm gonna drop the tarm again. Uh, so we don't have scent. Well, extra scent but who knows maybe one day we're out in this area and we're like desperate for food and so much for the not wanting the extra scent right we'll take you Carry on.
should probably do that. We got two bars. This is a terrible little spot because it's so lumpy that you can't even walk. <laughs> but if a wolf comes in that area, that's bad. Once we level out, I'll decide whether I should keep this out or put it away. I think I'll put it away. Can... Can we and should we go up this way wow this wind Gotta warm up somehow. like is this a different area than that other area where you go this way we got a carcass down there got a sapling take you oh we got a body and some sort of cave. It's a goddamn freezing. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. All right. Oh, this cave goes go back down to the basin. Well. We don't want to go back down to the basin, but we can harvest this while we warm up. Where's the entrance in the basin? How bad's our weight? 50. Now it's like 49 and a half. Pretty much 49, 49. I meant to kind of have a look over to our left to see if it goes further that way or if it just kind of comes over to here. Lots of cattails. Can you imagine being able to fish here? Not like I care, but I kind of do, actually. <laughs> Alright, well. We have a place to get to, so let's get to getting. There's two exits in the basin, one in the middle and one at the other end. Percent two. What's the temperature? Minus nine. But we have a wind block, right? That was with the wind block? Yeah. Just in case. I do think this is such a cool region though, like it, it really is. Be nice to learn this map well. There's the rock that looks like a big shipping container.
Alright, I'm curious about those timber wolves though. I'm hoping they're not booting around. I hope they're all just still at one apiece. Because I don't want to deal with them again right now. Alright, we can put that away. Uh, we'll leave that one maple sapling here. No point dragging it all over the map either, right? Alright, we should be able to see timber wolves. And it doesn't look like there's any packs down there. You're both maples. Uh... All three of you both. <laughs> well, we'll leave you here because apparently you cure items quite well. Uh, let's just do that and go. And there's three of these here. I'm gonna, I already have. The amount that I want, but just because there is timber wolves potentially, uh, may as well take some extras. Extras on top of our extras, and maybe even kind of scan around for that that one wolf that had our arrow. Oh, there's a pack right there. We sneak attack this guy. Like before he howls. Can you stop, please? an arrow uh, if I can get this guy and just get a hit on him before he howls that other one looks like he's coming over here too Maybe this guy we can get a shot off on. Uh, the one with my arrow ran off that way somewhere. Uh, ooh, hello. It's, it's good and bad that they went into flight mode. Because if we could just get a hit on one more of them, that pack is dealt with. We don't have to worry about it. You're coming back. Are you going to be in flight mode this time? That's what I was afraid of. Well, you're going to come back too, aren't you? If I can just get a head on. Oh, wow. They can detect you from so far. That was my hope, though, to get a head on shot. I don't want to do those like, oh, they're, you know, walking across and I got to hit them from there. had nothing all 
right, let's see if we can do this without getting hit. Hey, I hit you. Yeah, this is uh, bigger than a two pack. It's a three. And they're trying to surround me. Damn it. Where'd you go? Oh, wait. I think I got him. No, I didn't. Okay, we got blood loss. I gotta be careful. Oh, ankle shot. Alright, there we go. Alright, we got infection. That's why I brought the extras. Right, we're down to 28 arrows. I don't really know how many are running around right now, but uh, really? Oh, so cold. That's way too hard to hit. That's another three pack. We need to warm up. Oh. Yeah, that's a lot of timber wolves so far. Uh, we're at 28 arrows. We had 33. And we had one arrowhead in our backpack. So we'll check once we're inside the building warming up. We'll have a peek at how many we might have running around. Man, I love that mechanic that they have of trying to surround you. I mean, it's a royal pain in the butt. But it's also like, you know, I think that's what they would try to do in real life. Man, this pack is getting kind yeah, of luckily my shooting was a little bit better than yesterday. All right, so we have 28. We have 29. So we have four arrows, I believe. That are kicking around. Uh, hmm. Do that. Uh, I gotta make another another old man's beard. How's the clothes? I think. I hope they're good. Ooh. They're not good. <laughs> 75. That's not horrible. You're at 97. All right. Oh, did I miss this last time? Uh, let's eat and drink before we go out. And actually, what was our health at? Uh, we'll do that. I think I want to stay at the other cabin with the bear meat. Uh, 
That's an arrow. <laughs> I thought I heard something in this vicinity that was just shuffling around. Now, where is that? Is it one of those? That's kind of far. No, those are the two I just took down. Is it right there? You have my property. Or not. How do you not have an arrow? Like, how did you die and not have an arrow? Oh, maybe that was the one that broke. All right. Now, we can't do this unless we have an Aurora or Glimmer Fog anyways, right? Like, I can't just walk right in there and hit it. start collecting uh, feathers again. Hey. And scrap metal. Oh, is it just the shelf that I was triggered on? Yeah, we need it said the radio and the Polaroid, so Damn, I'm freezing. Yeah, that one cupboard, that's that's hilarious, right? I like that too. But yeah, it's completely covered by snow and you can still check it. That's another wolf right there. Oh, hey. And another one. Is this two arrows? There's one. There's another one. Make sure. Nice. We got 30. So we got two more still out in the wild, I believe, right? Because one of those arrowheads came from a broken arrow. still have that one uh at this point good luck finding it that wolf could have ran anywhere pretty sure that guy's despawned by now too so There's the cabin. I think this is the furthest I've ever seen that cabin. And been able to say, oh, okay, it's right there. <laughs> the path kind of helped. I like to run. I would like to get inside of there. Quick.
I just heard ptarmigan, but I don't know where I heard them. Right there. Is that an arrow coming to me? Gotcha. It's dusk, so I can't be far well. away. No, nope. I don't think that guy's got an arrow. I don't think he was hit. Yeah, this is like the infomercial, right? You get well, not one Timberwolf pack, not two Timberwolf packs, not three Timberwolf packs. There's more. I didn't want to shoot him. I heard him. That's why I stopped, but I actually came to my senses and said, don't shoot him because he's a singular wolf. So we might get an Aurora it's possible. Hey, somebody was here. Uh, you know what? The can works just as good as the... Just as good as a pot, right? Uh, I want to get some birch bark made up. Let's close the door. Let's actually put you up here. Yeah, I need three of those basically. And two herbal teas. Actually, I can't make two t two herbal teas. I only have Oh, I Oh, no. I only have one herbal tea left. I honestly thought I had enough. Let's drink one of those. Um, what are you reclaimed? We had a few of you. Um, actually, to be honest, I shouldn't have done that. Let's do that. And that's 21 minutes. Probably get the meat. And one feather. Another 21 minutes. We should get to bed. Oh, no Aurora. Not yet, anyway. In 11 minutes, I'm just gonna do that. Uh, seven minutes. I'm going to face the bed and I'm just going to harvest the rest of you up. And I am not actually going to drink the tea. We got 56. Uh, I'm going to save the tea in case we get... Uh, you're cured, you're cured. Okay. 
uh, in case we get insomnia at some point. Alright, let's eat these small ones. That's good. Again, I should have used my regular, like my sleeping bag, just to be extra safe on the temperature. I think inside here you shouldn't be worried about it, but I don't know. Sometimes I just don't trust things, right? All right. We got most of our condition back. We need our pot back. Uh, what else did we have? Uh, I wanted to leave some of this coal. Oh, hello, Mr. Pot. I'll leave 10 of you. Are these all cured? Cured guts apparently don't smell, right? At least that's how I'm gonna go with it. Uh, how much meat did we have? We have two. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Take four. Oh, you're just flying overhead. All right. So we have 29, 32, 32. Let's see if we can find so many, uh, some arrows. Go down here. Actually, no, let's stay up here. Who knows? Maybe we can see something up here that we couldn't see down there. Like crows. What's the wind? Minus 16. Oh. Well, if, if crows can fly overhead, if it's not too windy for that, they should fly around the carcasses, right? I think. Yeah, they're flying around the carcass. All right. Well, we're probably gonna end up double checking a few of them, but whatever. And get some more sticks. One way over there. Did we check that one? Uh, we checked these ones. But I don't think we checked this one. Ptarmigan. And another arrow. Make sure you're not holding another one. Alright, how many of these can we get? Is there only three or did one kind of go down the slope? Yeah, there's four. How 
Come on, little chicken. Oh, bugger. Well, it didn't scare him, so. I need you guys to stop running around. I need to have better precision with my mouse. <laughs> Is three. Okay, I got him. And there should be an arrow out here, right? Oh, I hope it didn't. Uh, uh, I hope it didn't go over this. Oh, okay, there it is. All right, and we definitely checked those. I remember that. Yeah, I think my mouse is just a little bit too fidgety sometimes. I've, I've said before, like the, that mouse pad that I use, the, the hardened one, I only use like a, I would say like a sixth of, of the size of it. Like I use a tiny little portion in the, the bottom left corner. And my mouse doesn't move as nicely on there as it does if I move my mouse over somewhere else. It's like way smoother because it's never been used over there. And I think I've, it's getting scuffed. I've even changed the, uh, the sliders on the mouse. So they're new and shiny. But yeah, it's just how it works for me. My, my hand only uses this one little tiny spot. And the worst thing is that that's where their logo is. <laughs> Alright, what is it? Our food and water is good. Got the handful of chickens. That's why you see, like, if I can get kind of aimed up to the side or, or ever so slightly before the, the ptarmigan or something, and you'll see me move into position. I find that's the easiest way for aiming on this super small target. Uh, make sure you say cooked. Do that. Uh, we got a we got a couple pieces of ptarmigan down now, don't we? Maybe we might have enough to repair our bedroll. If it needs it. I'm not doing it if it's in the 90s. But I think we do still need some clothing repairs too. Yeah, we have 72. Look at that. I think that's it for ptarmigan. I, for the most part, I'm, I'm going after them just to... Uh, what am I looking at in here? Uh, 97. Yeah, we're not doing that. Uh, for the most part, I'm going after them just to give me something to do. Because we have to wait between this cab and the other. Um... I don't want to get too far away and get glimmer fog or an aurora. Uh, we take these curtains. Uh, 
We got other curtains here. I'm gonna need more cloth, so. Uh, what is our cloth at? We're at 10, but whatever. Let's take it. Bird wants a stretch. How long are you? 10 minutes for two. Let's take these two. Time number two. Can we take these curtains? Shush. Shush. All right, we have far too much of alertness. Oh, I should have ate while we were warm. Oh, it's just regular. It was that? Right there. Is that a sapling? I don't know if that actually is. Uh, what am I doing? I'm eating and drinking and stretching. I'm almost thinking we should just go back to the base and... F I gotta go check this way. I can't auto walk through this though, so just give me a minute. There might be a sapling out here. It might not be. Just in case. Okay. Uh, do I see anything down here? No, I don't. Oh, it is a sapling. It's a birch one, too. How many arrows we at? 29. Yeah, let's go this way. Hey. Right. Is that another? Is that a maple? Okay. <laughs> I was about to stretch and I thought, wait a second. Okay, we got you. Let's grab these sticks and then... We will head to the next cabin and I will do my stretch whilst we walk. All right. Walk to these tree clusters. They seem to have saplings. There we go. Thanks, Mark. Whilst. I know, eh? Alright, did we check this one? Is this a wolf? Did we check them? I want these sticks, though. We'll find out if that's a... If it's gonna bear arrows. I think you've ruined me, Murd, with that stupid word. Because now I, 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 I can't not, at least, at the very least, I can't not have that word come into my head. Uh, you, I think you were Mr. Broken Arrow. Oh well. So sometimes I'll actually use the word, but sometimes I, I won't. But when I don't, it's still in my head that I might use it. If I use that word, will I have better friends? Will I have more fun? Will I get a better job? Will I meet a better wife? <laughs> like the infomercials always say. Well, I used my three 
spares, I may as well replenish the extra extras. I want to cook up this tarm again, but I don't want to do... I only have the one pot, right? Because I wasn't planning on cooking. Uh, we should probably... You know how cool it would be? We could do that. I guess we'll go right there. I'll make you happy, isn't that enough? <laughs> That's not what the infomercials all say. Come on, little fire. Uh let's throw a bunch of you on. We're at minus six. Jesus is cold. So by my estimation, seven sticks should have made it plus one. Or more. Okay, well, my estimation was wrong. <laughs> um, actually... something when I was making the fire. Oh, Jesus, Mert. That's not even close to being funny. Right, I'm going to go by weight. That way I can get rid of all the... Those are all one. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Yeah, you can put that away. Uh, what I want is the smaller ones. Yeah, I said quiet, not loud. You done scared him off. Now he's gone. Right there. He's a friendly wolf, though. He's friendly. How much time is on this fire? Two hours. Okay, here, 30 minutes. Uh, what was the time of day? It's night time. Maybe we get lucky and we get an aurora. Seven and fifteen. Um, oh, here, let's swap that. Let's do that. The sun is setting. It's gonna get a lot colder soon. I'll do it that way. I want to eat all the ptarmigan, not the uh, not the bear meat. I think we have, we have 25, 32, well, we're not in any rush, kinda, um, I don't think I'm gonna cook these ones, I will cook the ptarmigan for sure. Three, four, four. Oh, that was wrong. Forty-five, eighteen. Here, twenty-seven.
Let's do that. Twenty one twenty. Cook it. And these are all cooked now, right? They are. And what do we got in here? We got two of those. We still have 12. That's a good thing. Um, 42 minutes. How much water do we have? I can carry much more. All right, let's go. I don't think our sense is going to matter, right? The wolves have all been dealt with. Uh, let's go to the proper. I'm gonna use the radio just in case somebody's watching who hasn't seen this. Hasn't seen how it works. That wolf around the cabin was kind of spooky though, because like I said, I heard him when I was starting the fire. But I wasn't sure. what mood he was going to be in. Hey. Why are you back there? Well, that's what a timber wolf looks like in a uh, in an aurora. Aurora. That's how you speak when you have a mouthful of marbles. here because I don't want to come up to the top of that hill and start cresting it and that guy's like hey food and I'm gonna do this just in case I don't want to be the idiot that got attacked walking knowingly walking towards an Aurora Timberwolf Okay, that's good. Hey, they're quiet when they run off. Unlike during the day. They have manners. They're like that. Yeah, people are sleeping. It's like how they glow. <laughs> remember where exactly it was I may also have a cache around here maybe not 
All right, let's go in. This is one that when the safe house customization comes in, would be nice to clean up. Ooh, hey, come with me. Play the funky music. We've been there. Someone is stalking me. Even now, huddled here with the rats and the filth, he is searching. The mole I had feared, or the mountain pass is closed. Great Bear Island's instability, its many earthquakes and shifting mountains, were thought to be key attributes in our scientific game. And that proved partially true. Its gnashing rocks, the clash of old and new forces in opposition, did grant us a look in the right direction. But it's also trapped me here, with no retreat from these frozen peaks. I need to examine the data more closely. All I hold in my hands is a closed book. I must get higher to get the signal out, to let them know I persist in this hellish place. Getting a bit thirsty. Oh, I, was, I wasn't there in this run. That was in the other run. I thought that was my my brain was telling me that that was the uh oh hey hello uh the stairs at the weather station I'm not going to take these oh well, okay I'll take that Eddie Uh, you know what? I'm going to light the lantern. Just to be sure. Ooh, we got leather. I'm not sure I would have seen that leather without my lantern, so... That... plug we don't care here let's have a sip I think that's everything in here eh looks like it I like that you can break these down to get a can Basically breaking the lid off of it, eh? And what are you? You're plus two. Let's do that. And let's eat the tarm again. Have a little sip and we'll go to bed. Yeah, once safe house customization comes in, this place is such a pigsty. Like, it would be so nice to just be able to clean it. Get that out of the way. All right, time again first, right? Alright, so we're gonna find the access point to the high peak. I didn't find two supply caches out here, did I? to go where to go I want more feathers uh, 
Uh, let's go in here so I can look at uh, the Polaroids. Find the access to the high peak. Is that straight out the river? Yeah, that's what I thought. That's the one I thought. Um, yeah, I thought that was up at the, the weather station. That's where we're at. All right, well, let's, uh, how heavy are we? 47. Well, we might leave something at the, uh, fishing hut. I'm not sure I can carry much more. We've done summon the crows. Um, what do we have? We have four. We have 30. Okay. I just want to make sure that I had enough feathers that when we get to making more arrows, we'd actually can make them all. This is where the moose comes out now. We haven't gone down that way, have we? No, we didn't because we went up and across to the mine. My brain is focused on the ptarmigan. I keep telling myself, you don't need any. Now, I have a question. What is it in this story that, that tells you to go this way? Or do you just find it? We have 1.8 worth of sticks. We don't need all of you. Uh, we don't really need the scrap metal. And we can probably just keep these here for now. Summoning didn't work. Let's try again. He's probably lurking. He has a pretty lengthy streak. Mr. Fergalicious. It's probably a carcass, but my, my mind is hoping it's a it's a wolf with an arrow in it.
like a whole area out here, eh? Yeah, it's a formerly a big old fat juicy buck. Oh, okay. Initially, I turned around to make sure that uh, there wasn't an arrow around him. Some of the deer carcasses will have an arrow. And then I thought, hey, wait, there's a feather. But it's just his antler poking through the snow. Look up, way up. Should I warm up first? Ah, oh, we don't get one of those. All right, I want that. Uh, I, I was thinking about grabbing a stick. On little fire. Cause I knew I'd have to use a piece of coal. Uh make a bit more water. We're getting getting low. Oh hey. I have a can now too. Oh no, the weather. I'm going to leave that can here for now. And I am going to make you. Actually, what I should leave is the pot. Make sure there's nothing over here. Nope, doesn't look like it. All right. And we will be putting on our crampons. Um, actually, I'm going to drink this. And we'll do that. That is not the make sure there's nothing over here time number two. Your your memory ain't that good. Now this part sucks because the weather is turned and I don't know this area. Like I know this area way less than I know the down below area. think you can actually get lost up here though I think it's pretty linear it's just a matter if you can't see maybe you might just be running around in circles uh. oh we got a cave right there Do 
Nothing there. Ooh, and it's got coal. Romer's Cave. form. Let's try it again. I'm not sure I want to go out there just because I can't see. It's almost nighttime. I'd rather go out there on a nice clear night than during this. Oh, I still have that on me. Uh, well, it's a spare, but we may as well repair it. It'll turn into Our best pair and you are 97 97 okay uh, well I'm gonna do these they they'll go up by point three I think right that's a big deal yeah they go to 2.5 go up by 0.4 I think that's all the repairs I can do though I don't know that I have that much cloth oh I have apparently way more cloth than I ever really knew well I'm gonna repair everything then because I don't want to go out in a blizzard in a place that I'm not familiar with oh okay there I think we're good it's cleared up it's still somewhat light out interesting So I'm going to guess we got to go that way because it didn't look like this went anywhere. Yeah, let's go this way. Oh, it doesn't look like it goes anywhere either. I th oh wait, I didn't really go that way. I think we go that way Yeah Ooh, those look familiar those steps A bird. Got a piece of fur.
Apparently this used to be bug day. Luckily it's not. <laughs> we just did the limbo. What did that say? Reach the high peak plateau and look for signs of Rudiger and the foreman. I do think it would be nicer to be up here in daylight, but my fingers feel numb. You can always go back and hang on that rope and go to bed. I got so much alertness. If I actually knew the the direction that this all went, I'd actually be running. The uh, Shave down that that alertness. There's more ropes yet. I forgot about that. We gotta go down. Why? Why would we want to go down? We're supposed to be going up. They put this rope in here just for the sake of putting a rope. Hey, levitating firewood. Do you think that's a danger zone? I will not go in there. I wouldn't go in there if I were anyone. That looks like it's either instantly going to kill you or you're going to get stuck. Improvised crampons might pull this off. Might. <laughs> Man, I can't believe how long I played this game and I've never, not until the last, I think it was the last season, right? Our last run when I first made them. Maybe the run before, but... I don't think there's a single climb in the game with improvised crampons that you don't go through all your stamina, if that made any sense. I think every climb in the game you can do with those. Yeah, it doesn't make sense that the ones you make are better than the ones that you've, that, you know, the pre-mades. Oh, we got an Aurora. I can hear it. I can't see it. I would like a cave because I am freezing and I don't, what I don't want to do is make coffee to There's another rope, which I don't think we can climb. We shall see. There's a cave ahead. Good. them giving you materials because they know you probably can't make this climb. <laughs> you might be sleeping in a cave. This pack is getting kind of heavy.
Okay. Just making sure there's no coal. Go right down into this corner. Uh, what is the temperature in here? We should be fine without a fire, right? Let's eat some sardines. Ten hours. Ten hours and cross your fingers the whole time. Alright, uh we're gonna have to drink. And can we get more sleep? No. I'm going to pass time. And we'll sleep now. Alright, we got daylight. We're good. And... Let's get rid of the dog food. I'm going to keep the can. I don't know why. But I am going to. Stale chocolate bar tastes real good after dog food. Right. Um, don't want you. Go uh, hang out somewhere else. Perfect. Out of sight, out of mind. Uh, we may as well put the crampons on now while we're warm. And... I was wondering, why am I heavy? <laughs> I'm eating and drinking. How did I gain weight? The fur, I tell you, it's the fur. Feels like minus 24. I didn't actually notice what the what the actual temperature was though. Minus 57. Oh, so cold. Step climb. This is the coldest part of the region. Well, we are high up, very high. We oh, 
Another rose hip climb. And is this a cave or a tunnel? I don't remember. Is going to be sad she missed another long walk. <laughs> it's a tunnel. Oh, look what we see. Take some charcoal. This island was meant to give up its secrets to me. Knowledge wired into its very bones, the deep places under the earth. A new geology. It promised much. A crack in the window to the future. I knew we could not accomplish our goals and be certain of success or safety in doing so even if I could never have predicted this result. How powerful and destructive the amplification would be, the cascading, corrupting energy from the machine. But I chose to move forward. In the coming decades, these equivocations, these doubts will be meaningless. I still believe E.W. was right. He was already so close, and 100 years ago. But even with my more complex machine, I cannot prove it, yet. The cost has been high, and now I suspect it is time for me to pay as well. Even now my enemies laugh, as their agent tracks my movements, this stalker in the hills, and I am only getting weaker. There is a terrible shadow across my mind, gnawing on its edges. I cannot focus my thoughts. My dreams are strange, a deep, wide ocean, unending. All right, uh, that would have been way cooler to have been able to have made a fire. That's my bad. Come on, little fire. Uh, use one and check the temperature. Uh, I think two. that rope oh hey we got this track the slippery creep up here but he's moving fast stronger than he looks and just as I'm starting to fade I knew this might be a one-way trip but I like my odds for something better one last mission to fill the ledger before Moving on to better days. Debt's paid. The director off my back for good. <sighs> Some bright idea, huh? <sighs> I miss my brother. He would have loved this op. Can't. I can't really see his face anymore. <sighs> Feel bad for the guys that didn't get out. <sighs> God. Damn mine. Part of the gig to keep him in the dark, but this one hurt. Well then, 
It's almost kind of nice when the sun's up and the wind stops howling. <sighs> Onward. Gotta fix this. Finish it. All right. What do we got for meat? And I'm going to heat one of you up. And let's put you there. I, I wanted the coal because we're high up, right? Fly, little birdie. Now we're freezing again. Supply bin. And is there anything over here? No. Nothing new over here but a couple of broken ankles. Wait. I'm so cold. I'm warming up a bit. Oh, we got a box. Do I get back home? We'll warm up soon. Interesting. Alright, what can, uh, how much time? We got lots of time on there. Uh, we are way overweight. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Prepare these. And let's. What the heck, right? We got to get fully warm anyway. I don't know if I need that. Um, I can't take that hatchet. We're, we're struggling with our weight as is. I'm gonna guess that rope goes somewhere around here, right? And now back to Bunker Omega. I don't remember which Bunker Omega was. <laughs> Honestly, the only thing I remembered from here was the, the satellite dish and I remembered the ptarmigan. I didn't remember that there was uh, uh, what do you call uh, diaries to be read. I actually thought that this continued on upwards. <laughs> Deploy that. And see if I can get a wind block. Uh, I gotta eat as much of this as I can, which is not very much. Um, this might actually do it. Uh, yeah, 45, 16. Oh, the one in the airfield is Bunker Omega. Okay. The only time I know the names of those bunkers is when I'm actually entering them and it flashes on my screen. <laughs> Now, where are we? This is so cold. I 
this. I want to lay down for a bit. Oh, this is where I almost died. No? I remember complaining about this saying like it doesn't look like a passageway. Yeah, I totally got annoyed here last time. That that really didn't look like a passageway. It kind of did um, this time, but I think that's only because I remembered that. I don't know. Who knows? Maybe I'm the only person in the Long Dark community who's who was stymied by that one. <laughs> Uh, we need a fire real bad. And it's real windy. Minus 27 on the wind. We... Okay, we do have the insulation on, not the crampons. So now I'm in a spot where I should be able to see where I goaded from, right? The blind goat that led me to safety. I'll only do it or look for it when I'm warm. Do we get a wind block anywhere in here? Right there. We got a wind block, but we don't have flat terrain. up in the basin which isn't here ah! oh son of a leave it to hinderland to have like a train of 27 timber wolves in a spot that they're gonna break all your limbs Seriously, I need a fire. Oh, damn it. I don't want to go down there because... I mean, I don't want to die. Just sauntering sideways. <laughs> yeah, five timber wolves. Those first four that were in a line were kind of funny. Um, uh, is that a cave? That is a cave. No, it's not. Oh, is this? No, this isn't that tunnel. Uh... 
do that. They were reenacting the Beatles crossing the road. A <laughs> uh, piece of coal, I think, should do it. And we'll make some water. What else can I throw on here? I want three arrows. There we go. We got three. Four until boiled. Let's take that. Oh, hey. Let's do that. And... I don't, I'm not sure if I want to go through here or if I want to go down here. I'm going to go down here. Come out here, have a look. Yeah, there's a log crossing right there. Where does that go? Let's go this way because I hit that one, but I hit him in the ankle. We're we at 28 arrows now. That guy might take a while to go down. shot like that. You gotta hit. Wait a second. Okay. Right, keep your eyes peeled. You got a arrow missing. still unsure if I should have went up if I should have went that way or if I should go this way but I think I'm committed to going this way until it says sorry you can't go this way anymore
Oh, we're right here. Oh, dang, I didn't even see him. We are right here. Return to the Omega Bunker and investigate the area shown in the Polaroid. Oh, seems they want us to leave. Um, make sure I checked you. Oh, I did it. Yes, there we go. We got another arrow. Let's grab these. Now, where do we want to go? Do we want it that way or that way? Let me think. Let me think. I think I got to go this way because I have, I left all that stuff at the fishing hut. So this way it is. And can I get, yeah, we can just go that way if we wanted to one day, right? I'm going to leave the feathers. I can't feel my hands. I think we'll jump into the building, uh, skip time to get uh, warmed up. And continue on over to the the fishing hut, grab all our stuff and come back to this. Um, I don't know, maybe or maybe we go up to the other one. Depends on what the what the visibility is like. It looks like we might be getting bad weather again. We'll see, but I want to get that stuff from from the fishing hut before I forget because I literally almost forgot. If I put it off till tomorrow, I will not remember. I'm sure you'll remind me, but... Let's get it now. Damn, I'm freezing. go I'm not sure I can carry much um here actually let's sleep for an hour there we go now we don't have to worry as much about our alertness uh what am I looking at Oh, maybe here. Yeah, okay. I knew I wanted to be on a different screen. I just didn't remember which screen I wanted to be on. Like, I know I need to look at a different screen, but I don't remember why. <laughs> Let's run. a moose now nope. uh, we still have to go that way too so I don't think I don't think we're just gonna pack up and leave 
There's still some areas we haven't been to here. I want my sticks. Um, I'm going to take that. We'll make some hooks with it or something. Good to go. Uh, up there or down here? Hey, look what I have. Dang it. I don't know that I needed to bring that down with us. Yeah, I think we'll go into this building instead of over there. Um, I think I want to go down into the basin again. There it is. It's way up there. Uh, we're at 29 arrows. And we can make another four. I don't know. We'll see what we're going to do. I don't know. I'm undecided, but we'll go to this building for now. Starting to feel numb. Well, so far we've dealt with a the Timberwolves and Sundered Pass with just the bow. I'm getting more confident with that. Two runs ago, I would not have wanted to do it. Like, no. No chance. Uh, I believe... Well, I don't know if there's Timberwolves that way. I'm trying to remember that very first time I came here. And, uh, I think you were telling me I took the bad way. <laughs> Trying to remember where those Timberwolves were. They were hourly. Oh, you're a plus eight. That is a lot. Can I get off of there? Um, uh, what can we do in here? Don't want to use the hatchet. Drop any of this gear. Did we have reclaimed wood that we can get down here? We took it. And it looks like everything's going to be hatchet. Except for cloth. And we don't really have 12. Eh. Well. Feels like 30. I wonder if the temperature upstairs is the same. It is. Alright. Uh, one thing I gotta do. Uh, I don't have to drop you because you're... You're cured. You're cured. You're green. You're green. Look at that. We got 72. 72. You're at 97, 99, right? Yeah. Or 93, 99. Oh, we can uh, fill you up. Do that. And anything else? What's our bow like? Ooh. Our sport bow is down to 54. 
Wow, let's eat you. Get rid of you. That's good. Man, I could use a drink. Three seventy. Let's drink a birch bark just to make good and sure we have all of our condition when we wake up. Whoops, hey, forgot. Need more water. There we go. And I think I'll end this here. So for those of you on YouTube, if you like what you saw, please like and subscribe and I will see you all tomorrow.